It's Way Up with Angela Yee. I'm Angela Yee, and Jasmine from the Jasmine brand is here. What's up, Jasmine? Happy Friday. It's Friday, Angela. Oh, my gosh. It's Friday, but the work doesn't stop. We're headed to Atlanta mm-hmm. to Strength of a Woman today. Yes. All right. Excited to see that. You know I love some Mary J. Blige, you too. Do. I do, too. All right. All right. Well, let's get into this yeeti. Mm-hmm. Uh, Brian McKnight has had to do some damage control. Woo. Now, they were dragging him on social media. Yeah. He posted a picture with his family. And it's his blended family. Mm -hmm. He says, spending my birthday with the five people I love the most in the world, my family. Thank you, baby, for making this day the best that it can that it can. Now, I guess, um, you know, he posted a video also earlier of his stepdaughter where it seemed like his real daughter. Not biological. Biological. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. I didn't mean to say it like that. (laughs) Uh, Daughter didn't exist. Right. So he's had some issues with his biological daughter. Um, She actually had to disclose her entire sexual history in court because he had posted she had some years earlier and while a minor engaged in sexual relations with an older cousin. Oh gosh. Yes. Why would he post that? He posted it and deleted it, and then she had to do that in court, and then uh, she sued him for defamation. They actually had a private settlement that they reached after that. Oh, my gosh. But here is Brian McKnight now uh, addressing these allegations of abandonment. He said, not sure how these posts that have been sitting here this whole time were left out of the false narrative that is trending. Abandonment, there's always more to every story. Stay tuned, and here's what he said. There is a very simple reason why I post about some of my children on social media and not others. The children that I do not currently have relationships with, I don't post about them. Instead, I post about the children with whom I do have relationships, with whom I am proud of, and about whom I want to share my pride in their accomplishments. I don't live in the past. I live in the present and the future. Now, people also didn't like the fact that earlier um, he had also posted his stepdaughter and said, Jules, I became a girl dad because of you, oh, and Lord. I couldn't have asked for a better <laughs> daughter. Here's to you, Jules, the perfect daughter I always wanted. Oh, my. That's so many digs and so many jabs. Do you uh, think that video that he posted helped the situation? No, I don't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> All right. Well, that is your Brian McKnight story. He's Yee. very angry at y'all uh, trying to make this narrative about him. I don't know if we're making the narrative or if. He's helping the narrative. And speaking of relationships between uh, parents, mm-hmm. right? Black China is celebrating her 35th birthday, and she's with her mom. Yeah. Tokyo Tony, here's the video that she posted. Oh, look at that. Doing it, Baba Love Love. <laughs> They, they be putting on a front for the gram. Those two have been through a lot. They have. But the good thing is that they still manage to come back together and love each other. And you know what I think part of it is? I think... I think Black China kind of accepts her mom for who she is and kind of knows, you know, my mom really loves me. But, you know, we have these issues and I think she just wants to kind of continue to move forward and not kind of dwell on some of the crazy stuff her mama said. And we also don't know what goes on behind the scenes with people's families either. We so. don't. And and then you see that she got a new, uh, Tokyo Tony got a new uh, tattoo of uh, Black China's name. So, Angela. What? She has, no, I'm saying she got, oh. she got that tattoo on her. I think you're saying, hey, Angela. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hear you. All right, well, that is your Yeti. And when we come back, we have New Music Friday. It is a Friday, and there's a lot going on today, and a lot of it has to do with NBA Youngboy. Okay. All right, it's Way Up with Angela Yee.